guys it's me I'm back all my pretties I am back this is Ann and I decided to do a little something for spring since it's equinox so I got out a couple of palettes I got out the Elsa palette that I've had for a little bit now because it's got all kinds of pretty springy colors no shade names, but lots of pretty colors. The other palette that I got out, some of you are very familiar with. It is the Morphe 35M. And, yeah, I know. I don't talk about buying big names. And, okay, this is not the highest name on the list. However, a darling friend of mine was cleaning out her dupes and her old backups. And she said, hey, I know you're on a budget. Would you like some of these, you know, backups and dupes that I've got? And I'm going, oh, 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 oh. So she sent me some of the stuff. And that's how I got some really interesting things, you know? Like, like you know, the Wander Mascara and the 35M and stuff like that there. I love you. Miss Pink Sweets. Anyway, I decided we could use a little spring for the equinox. This is a solar point on the calendar. From this point on, the days will start to get noticeably longer until we get to midsummer, where it starts to drop back down again to the fall equinox. We have for the next day or two approximately 12 hours of night, 12 hours of day. And that varies by a few ticks here and there. So, you know, some people do equinox on the 20th, some people do it on the 21st. It's like just pick a day. And technically, it is the first day of spring. So I did a little something with some pale colors and some green and said, oh, look, the spring flowers are blooming. Anyway, if you want to see how I did this, sit right there. Don't go anywhere.
that was fun this is the finished look I hope you all enjoyed the video nice and short you know don't want to have to make you sit there all day I don't know it'd be kind of fun though I enjoy the company anyway if you like what you saw please come back I will continue doing this as long as people come back if you have any questions or want to say anything about the look or, like I said, question the work, I can answer pretty much anything that you put in the comments, except for things like, you know, where I learned my technique. Is there a specific name for my techniques? Yeah, the answer is no. I've just been doing this since I was about 16 and having a blast with it. And I've picked up things over time. It's like I've been in and out of theater things and I do science fiction and fantasy cosplay, which is costuming yourself like a character from a comic book or a movie or something like that, and I've been doing that for years. So I've also done Renaissance festivals where I get dressed and all that lovely stuff. And I have picked up some of what I've learned from my husband who was a professional theater um, makeup artist. So, you know, it's a little of this and a little of that. Anyway, I hope you've had a good day or a good night or whichever, since I have no idea where you are. I hope you enjoyed it. Please come back and visit and be good. <laughs>